Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm a board certified dermatologist speaking to you today about a situation we're facing here. I'm gonna be doing a series of these videos to give info to the community about what we know about the now labeled COVID-19, which stands for coronavirus disease and the number 19 is for 2019 when it was first detected, though the outbreak started in 2020 in the US. So I think to understand what COVID-19 is, you actually have to understand what a virus is and what it can do to your body. They're microscopic parasites that are smaller than bacteria. They lack the capacity to thrive and reproduce outside of a host. And in this case, the host is you and your body. So they use you to replicate and they use their own RNA to enter into you and kind of mix it into your body. So in this animation, you'll see what's depicted to be either RNA or DNA because viruses can use either or, but in COVID-19, it's specifically RNA. Here you see the virus um, that is attaching itself to the host cell surface. It does so by recognizing and binding to the cell surface receptor, like two interlocking puzzle pieces of sorts. And basically it'll bind to that same receptor and the virus can then enter into the actual cell. Viruses use these cell receptors to their advantage, but usually these receptors are designed to serve the actual cell. So we believe the source of COVID-19 is an animal. In this case, we believe it's a bat that bit a pangolin. I'm going to stop right here because if you're anything like me, you're like, what the heck is a pangolin? Well, it's a scaled mammal that's endangered in China. And you can see it here in the Jungle Book movie. So apparently it's got a famous debut. Someone then consumed that infected pangolin, and then as we know it, it has human-to-human -human spread. This virus is airborne. As opposed to bodily fluids through sexual contact or ingestion through food, this is why sanitary measures need to be um, heightened at this moment, and you need to minimize exposure with other humans. In my next video, I'm going to discuss how to minimize spread of the virus and why social distancing matters. If we get to um, if you want to get any more updates or get on my new videos, please subscribe below. And if you have any questions, um, leave them below as well. I'd love to answer them. All right. Take care. And like everyone is saying in the U.S. right now, wash your hands and keep your distance. Bye.